Hello and welcome to another one of my weekend projects. Um, for this project we're going to be making lye. Uh, lye is used for making soap, it's used in animal skins, it has multiple purposes. Um, used in, as a drain cleaner, all kinds of stuff. Um, to make lye water, uh, first you take two buckets and the first one, drill a bunch of holes in, in the sides, uh, all, all around the side, make a strain rod of it. Then layer the bottom of it with rocks, um, and then above that you would layer it with dried grass and hardwood ashes all the way to the top. Just keep layering it, dried grass, hardwood ashes, um, and that's where you're going to get your lye from. Take distilled water uh, or rainwater, that's a free method, um, collect some rainwater, pour it through. If, the, uh, if it's too strong, add more water. If it's not strong enough, take your lye water and cycle it through the ashes again and just keep doing it until it's strong enough. Um, the uh, collection bucket at the bottom, you're going to need a, uh, a Teflon valve or plastic valve at the bottom. Uh, for, this, uh, for this, don't use metal. Um, you, you'll end up contaminating your lye and it eats at the metal, so you don't want to do that. Um, and then once you've got your lye strong enough, you can save it in a plastic jug and just store it in a uh, in a cool dry spot in a cool spot. Um, and that's how you make lye water. Oh, something else to uh, keep in mind. Once you pour the the uh, water through, allow it to settle off for a little bit. Um, if you have, uh, I would set the valve up the side of the bucket, probably about an inch, inch and a half, at least enough to clear the the valve handle. And this also allows any kind of particle particulates or uh, any kind of dirt and such to just settle at the bottom and not contaminate your uh, your lye water. And that's it.